What's going on guys, True here bringing you guys Kill I Kill episode 19 review. We're going to make this one pretty short because this episode was just kind of short in my opinion. It kind of flew by for me. It was a basically a recap and a kind of a time lapse after the the events that happened at, you know, the Hanjo High when the real, or I mean the, you know, the mom takes over and she turns everyone basically into her slaves. And you have them kind of on the rebellion, kind of like some Terminator stuff going on here. But we have it's kind of like the aftermath of what happened. We have, you know, Matoy, her family, or... Oh, <laughs> actually, in the beginning, I, I think they kind of hinted it last episode, but they finally brought it in and they confirmed that, that, she, is, that she is Ryuka's mom. And it's pretty cool because you're like, what the? What, what? And then Sasuke's like, I have a sister. What the? She's my sister. Like, what the heck? And it was just kind of like crazy. And how in the beginning when you think that Dr. Matoy was not her father, it actually was. Because if you kind of wait maybe like 15, 16 minutes in, there's kind of like a, a scene of how he faked his own death, which I didn't really see coming, which is pretty cool. And like how he altered his body's like configuration with his bones and stuff. That was pretty cool. Did not see that one coming, but that is her real father and that is her real mother. So that's pretty insane. Some pretty heavy stuff going on for this episode. We're almost in the 20s, like I said last episode. I think it ends somewhere in the 20s this season. I hopefully they make more seasons. I really hope they do. And it's pretty intense right now. But you have like this really gritty, really underground kind of like dungeon feeling. How they're all like fighting against blah 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 whatever, whatever trying to kill them. Basically the clothing. It's kind of like this rebellion kind of Star Wars stuff going on. You know they gotta fight. And get their stuff back and get their freedom back and then you have how all the people that used to be against each other finally came together and became a bond and they wanted like human yeah, civilization to you know thrive again and then you have this whole internal battle with Ryuko and how apparently at the end she just blows up and she's like I don't want to wear you anymore get out of here so get to you're a monster like me and you're like, what the heck? Like this whole season, this whole series, she's been committed 100% to the, you know, her, her Sengetsu. And you're just like, what the? Why would you say that? But I cannot wait to see what happens there. Looks like there's gonna be some pretty fire stuff. And I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick review. I don't know what's happening. It was just, I wasn't really feeling how I usually feel when I was watching Kill. I killed today. So hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, I'm Drew. Until next time.